And I was just like, you know what? It's always been in the back of my mind. I just got to get this thing done um, and, and just do it and try to realize my dreams. Columbia author Yasmin McClinton has always been passionate about writing. When I was young and I always wanted to be a writer, back then I really didn't know that there was a career in, in, publish, in publication. Um, and I just, had I known, then that's what I would have gone and, and done. But I didn't. So I was like, well, if I can't write, then I guess I'll just teach about it. And so that's what I did for all this time is to be an English teacher. Yasmin says she put writing away when she had her two daughters, but decided now is a better time than ever to pick it up again. The former ELE teacher has finished her first novel, a crime fiction that hasn't hit shelves yet, but has already won a prestigious award. And so when I um, found out about this, um, this award um, and the grant and everything, then I just applied for and gave them um, like a 5,000 word sample. At that time, it was just completed and it was going through revision. While Yasmin was on the hunt for an agent for her novel, she found out that she won the Eleanor Taylor Bland Crime Fiction Writers of Color Award by Sisters in Crime. And I was like, oh my gosh, I can't believe it. Like, oh my gosh. <laughs> This stuff doesn't happen to me. Yasmin is the seventh recipient of this award and a $2,000 scholarship that is a memory of African-American crime fiction author Eleanor Taylor Bland, created by the Sisters in Crime organization to celebrate excellence and diversity in crime writing. And I was up against some really stiff competition and uh, I, that's why I was just like so surprised. And so the out um, the, the feedback, the congratulations from everyone that I've received has been so, you know, it just makes me get like, you know, emotional because I'm just like, wow. While she continues the process of publication, Yasmin is already working on her second novel. To follow along Yasmin's journey, head to our website at WLTX.com slash Street Squad.